can read her diary. I would if I knew where... Oh, it's the book right here. You know what? I'll leave. I'll leave for now. I'll acquiesce and see if she goes to sleep. I just see her looking out of the corner of her eyes. I'm like crawling down the stairs. She's not going to sleep. Then again, it is early morning. Leave your bedroom, please. I thought that she'd go for like a nap or something. Oh, she actually has a cute walking animation for going downstairs. She never sleeps? That's terrifying. This looks like Pia's diary. It seems she's only just started writing in it. Read. Grandmother says she conspired with Princess Zelda and Auntie Pura a hundred years ago. They decided to put a lone swordsman into a long sleep so as to prepare for the time that was foretold in Legends. The name of that swordsman is Link. Since then, Grandmother has been waiting for him to reappear after all this time. I, too, pray that he awakens for soon video game. Video game, video game. Like, only kids sleep. Weird. Um... Rachel. What? Did you ever play Skyward Sword? No. Did you ever see anything for Skyward Sword? That, wait, is that another, I'm assuming that's another Zelda game, yeah. correct? No, the only game I ever played or <laughs> did anything with was, um, this one. I'm gonna make you very happy, but also very unhappy. Okay, that's no, that's a normal day in the life of yep, us. Yep, I know. Yeah, I know. You don't need to say that. The, the audience understands. <laughs> um... No, what I was going to say is go and look up The Legend of Zelda's Skyward Sword Demise. You'll you'll be very pleased but also very unhappy. Um, Played Skyward Sword, I like, am Master currently Sword unable to type things just due to the fact that I'm trying to fix something. Can you just tell me what it is, please? Well, no, you'd need to see him. God, fuck it. Right. Do it when you're available. Jesus Christ. Don't sit there and be like, I gotta do it right now. I'll forget. Big slug. No, fuck? he's not a big slug. What's, what's Is Demise name? the Soul Eater boy who turns into a sword? No, that's Girahim. Although Rachel would like Girahim as well. Demise like death. Orange fire hair? Yeah, buff boy. I'm not attracted to him. He's actually kind of... Oh, wow. Uh, wow. So... If he kept his mouth shut, I would let him fuck me. So that is... The origin of Ganon. Oh, neat. Um, he is the, like, demon king. Right? And the, the goddess Hylia... Incarnates herself into Zelda... In sealing him away... Um, and her, like, human worshipper slash lover, the origin of Link, like, fights him and beats his shit in. Um, and then, like, you know, future, futurize it, like, Link and Zelda are back and he's just trying to get out. And then he gets out and fights Link again, and he gets fucking killed this time instead of just sealed away. And he says, like, hey... Yeah, you fucking killed me. Congrats. Guess what? I'm so pissed about this. I will come back forever to fuck up everything. <laughs> Demise is like pre-Ganon Ganon. Yeah. So Ganon is the eternal reincarnation of Demise because he's just so fucking pissed that Link killed him. He's just salty. He's a salty, salty boy. Yeah. But here's the other thing. When you have free time, just, like, look up Groose. Why? Because he, he looks like a fucking idiot. Groose is... G-R-U-C? 
No, no, like G R O O S E, like a bird, Groose. Oh. He yeah, is. He looks like a dummy. He, but notice something very similar about him? No. His hair is red, his skin is tan, his eyes are yellow. He is the origin of the Gerudo people. Oh, he is a guy who shows up and is like, Yo, you and Zelda are making eyes at each other? Guess what? I'm gonna fuck her. And then Link is like, No, but you're not. And she's like, No, but you're not. Like, Groose's life is suffering and being inadequate. Despite being jacked. And then he ends up becoming, like, somehow a, like, technological whiz, which is super weird. Yeah, Groose is a total douche. He, he really comes back for it, from it, though. Like... Jesus Christ! I cannot, I cannot use heavy swords. I get my shit pushed in every single time I try to fight. That said, that was a great death because Link just decided to become one with the Earth. God, I just, I love, though, the fact that Ganon is the descendant of some dumbass, as well as the reincarnation of a god. Because it's just like, he's reincarnated from this god of, you know, death and hatred into the progeny of a guy whose entire reason for hating Link was because Zelda wanted to bone him. Like, just what a stupid curse for that bloodline. God, I, I, I'm i actually just going to get my shit rocked every single time I try to use this thing. The wind-up time is crazy. I'm just... I'm just ne- I should just never use them. I honestly shouldn't. Okay, there's too many of you going on at once right now. Oh my god, I got fucking killed by a stick! Yeah, I should just switch to a faster weapon. But I won't! Because I'm stubborn like that. Until I can get a reliable source. I understand I can Skyrim heal. I choose not to. I was literally just like shoving apples in my face earlier. I choose not to do this. I'm stubborn like that. Clearly, you have not been watching the God of War, where I intentionally fight enemies that are so hard that they have skulls. No, 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 they've got, like, skulls. Like, I understand you're being facetious as well. But I'm just saying, like, they have, like, skulls on their HP bars, and I'm just walking up to them, like, I wonder if I can kill this? The answer is no. That one rolled a bit too far away there. You know what? Hold on. We don't- we don't need ones that roll. I was being facetious, but I also didn't understand. Ah, okay. This is so stupid, but I'm actually really enjoying just this being a legitimate strategy. Mostly just because, like, wow, they just... They just keep doing it. Oh, wait, that one saw me? Wait, did they... They saw me because I cleared that tree? That tree was what was hiding me? That's crazy that what was keeping me safe was a fucking tree. That tree's hitbox must have been gigantic. Ooh. 
Well, that's one poor boy. Hey there. Wow, you're really, uh, you're really, you're really taking that, huh? The bombs AOE is huge. I wasn't, I wasn't really referring to that, though. It was more along the lines of the fact that, like, when that tree was up, they could not see me. That was more the curiosity. See, like... Just the second you whiff, it just fuckles you. It's crazy. That's a boy, did that guy go flying? She is complete. Just gotta get a name for her now. Feel free to post it in art chat, by the way. I never put anything there anymore because I don't draw anymore. Despite the tablet. I mean, I should say, I draw with the tablet, but it's bad. Um, I just found some maracas. No context on that. Just maracas. That's a key item, too. That's super weird. They're for later. Okay. Uh, hi! Random dude. Hi. Hi. Nothing gets me going like the sight of a treacherous cliff. Man, like looking over the edge of a cliff and seeing how high up I am, nothing gets me harder than that. I can't beat hmm. off unless I'm hanging off a ledge, I tell you what. It's actually right there. The big Korok. It just a random dude selling bugs and other shit. Ooh. Well, Beetle is in this game. I hate Beetle. How is it that you, like, slide downhill and stuff again? Like, going on your shield. How do you do that? Or do you have to be in, like, a snow area? Because I thought you didn't need to be in a snow area to do that. Or is it that it can't be, like, the shitty wooden one? I, I want to remember how to, like, go nuts in that way. Hold the shield button. Yep. Hmm. I feel like I might be missing something. I feel like I'm doing what I'm being told, but apparently not in the right fashion or something. I remember that, like, we figured it out for, like, 20 seconds before. Wow, we're really getting some air on this hill, though. Shaka Laka. Oh my god, your face. Holy so shit. So I posted her in your art chat thing. I noticed. Isn't she cute? She's cute. 
Now I'm just gonna make chibis of her. And then one day she'll become popular enough where I can sell shit of her. <laughs> and then get called racist because they're brown and you're not. Yeah. I can't wait for Twitter and Tumblr to lose their shit. Yep. 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 <laughs> <sighs> well, just like people gave me shit for, um. Hold ZL, then jump on a button. Got it. People gave me shit for the... On the A button, by the way, not A button. I'm an idiot. Longest. My brain. People gave me shit for the longest time, but, like, I draw women that are, like, bigger and have giant tits until they found out that I was a woman. <laughs> and then they gave me a little bit more slack. There's something really wrong with my name. maracas. The Korok seeds are gone. Drawn tits. Oh my god. Ow. I mean, I guess give me more weapons. Wow, I hate this. Wow, it's like I have to deal with Tingle, except it's also still shit. He does it every single time. Is there a way to... There is a way to skip it. Thank you. So we're just gonna do this. Oh. Um. No, you're... Wow, I hate you. Give me two upgrades. You are a, you are a trash man. Forgot about this entirely. Look at that. I forgot like the Sheikah Slate is a usable thing, like a cell phone. Yeah, I don't want to go back to the, like, the forest, though, is the thing. I want to just get them out of my inventory now, but that's fine. God, I hate this, though. Like, the control scheme is just so fucked for me because of just every other game in existence. Like, I can't believe that it's been literal months and I come back and I'm experiencing the exact same problem. Just due to the sheer merit of, like, several games that I am playing having similar control schemes. But then this one having very different things. What the hell is going on down there? And will I die if I sail to it is the real question. Oh, it's a lizard! That's like a bearded dragon! Well, that was super weird to encounter. I got this game saves a lot. It makes me not actually care about saving. You can pick up lizards. Oh! 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 Alright, well, that was an attempt. Come on, let me up as high as I can get on this. That's some fire and shit over there, I don't really care for that. It's kind of required to get through the lava area. Fantastic.
Go. Oh. What are you? Is that a whiz robe? Whoa, hey. Yeah, you're a whiz robe, all right. Wow. You're a dick of one, too. Boy, do I... Boy, do I hate this. Wow, I absolutely hate this. <laughs> this is awful. Just, just awful. Yeah, it's, 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 it's very hot. I wonder why it is so hot. Also, I'm not even going to make a comment on it being a valid temperature gauge. God, I hate this, though. Why is this, like, an actual, like, problem? This is absurd. I don't think I have anything that makes, like, shit cold. I didn't think that fighting a whiz robe was going to be this much of an aggravating factor. I thought it would be like, hey, look at that. It's flying around. Time to shoot it. Nope. It's just like, hey, guess what? We're going to slowly cook you alive like a Japanese hornet. Oh, get out of here. Oh, God. There's so many of you all of a sudden. There we go. Oh yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. I wanted a bunch of bad eyes. Listen, I don't want to jump into the water. I want to kill. I'm mad. It works. Yeah, full moon soon, but such is life, right? Listen, he'll be back in a second, but by then I'll be gone. Or not. Never mind. My internet died. Yeah, I was wondering what had happened there. Link. Link. What a horrible night to have a curse. Rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters Return to flesh. 
I'm sure glad they showed me what Liz Foles look like in this game, so that way I could have that spoiled for me. Next Zelda should be Legend of Zelda Unleash, where Link becomes a werewolf. Let's not talk about that. Wow, that, that guy's really fucking following me, too. I'm surprised he's being so persistent. Let's not talk about the tangible furry market, okay? Wow, that guy's got some range to him. Holy shit. I did not think that he'd be coming up here. Buddy, you gotta get a life, my dude. Like, this is not the way. Like, actually not the way. What'd that give me? Flint! Hey! Nah. God, so many wings. Like, at some point, I'm going to just be able to make my own wings and fly away on those. I'm getting so many of them. Oh, shit. Oh, no! All of my goods! Ooh, diamonds. Hey there. All right, I thought that there was at least, yeah, 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 yeah. Get all of these. We can sell them for money. We can sell them for big money. Diamonds are worth 500 rupees, my dude. That's like enough for a chest piece. This is extremely money, my monies. Incredibly money. Very high money. A lot of money for the money, money. It's crazy. And this is some distance that we're traveling to. I didn't realize that this game was going to be like this big. I'm actually pretty pleased about it though. Um, it <laughs> Sure. I don't even care that my sword is bust out. That's like whatever. Mostly because... Um... Sure. Um. Oh, wait, am I full? Oh. The fire rod is, uh. is a melee weapon. Weird. Barely even started with how big the game is. Oh, hey there. You have a weird nose. Goat butter, fresh milk, and a... No, dude. Are you 
ready. I don't know, am I ready? How ready do I have to be? That's the real question. Oh, hey! Shit, hi dude. Oh. Get out. I mean, we have a lot of big hits, but we also have this. And just to add insult injury. That's pretty good. Those things break like too easily, the hose, but they have like good damage to them. We're gonna grab it. I also break too easily. Uh... Excuse me? Get it? I'm a hoe. I'm yeah, I know, I, I got that, but it was just like, oof. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Alright, well now I have like three farming implements in my inventory, so apparently this is my life. There's some shit going on over there that I just don't really feel like dealing with. Also, you don't break that easily. Not exactly resilient either, though. That fox doesn't give a shit. Hey there. What's up? Yeah. Hey there. Hey there. Okay, you're just you're just a fox. Oh wow, that's that's uh that's a lot of enemies over the hill. Wow. Wow, they're going after that deer too. Ow, you dick. Get out. Alright, well. Oh, that's the wrong kind of arrow to have equipped. Oh, well, that's also not what I intended. I always forget that this bow is not hit scan. Like, it doesn't just go, it has drop to it, which is always super confusing. Ah, fuck it. We're just gonna go with my classics and just keep exploding everything. Oh god, Link does not have any, like, throwing capacity either. Holy shit. Come on. Where is he trying to path? Oh, he went to get a shield. Come on, guys. I'm trying to notify them that I'm here, but only this one guy cares. It's crazy. I wonder if I can lure him. Wow. Alright, I guess I just got out of that fight. That really wasn't my intended, you know, goal in that, but I guess that's how it played out. Also, I'm gonna start heading to bed, because it's fucking 12.30 and I gotta get up in five hours. Yeah, I figured that you would be going to bed soon. I should be getting ready to, because I have to wake up for like... 10... Well, I don't have to wake up for 10. I have to work at like 10. Yeah. Alright, bye. And she's out. I am pretty mad that it started to rain. Because I didn't know about surfaces getting slick.
Oh my god. This makes me so furious. I'm goddamn furious George right now. You know what? Screw it. This boat's ours. Maybe it's not? This would have been the time to have one of those- Ah! Korok leaves. To- Ow! Oh my god. What a dick. Oh my god! He's actually an ace shot. I'm dealing with the Shar Osnabal of Octoroks. Where's one of my, like, cooked meals? No, oh, no, yeah. all right. Wow, you dickhead. Wow, holy crap. Okay, so like they've really decided that that's not how they want that to get handled anymore. The good old Zelda classic, no longer in business. I tried arrows last time and it didn't work. Is that just like me being a terrible shot or do they need to take like more damage than a standard octo? Oh, well, apparently it worked on this one. Okay, so it was just me being a bad shot earlier. Or are there variants? Because I, I swear to God I shot one previously. Oh, Jesus Christ. Your farming implement is badly damaged. Hey there, buddy. It's cool, come on. That's cool. Don't worry about it. Oh my god, that was brutal. So is this, though. Hey, my dude, what's up? Oh. Oh my god, the range! I should have figured they're so big on those boys. Well, that was less than good. You know what? Let's actually use some like big tools to fight. Like let's be let's be real boys. Let's let's use the the farming hoe, which I I just did not equip. God, the, the, the hoe is proving to be, like, our greatest ally. Wait, are bombs not... Oh, okay. Bombs are not, uh... That was the wrong ability. I thought I was using Magnesis. Can I not... Oh, you gotta get, like, the perfect... The perfect angle on it. You know what? I should have smacked this guy up with this. I should have used the... I should have used the chest to do that. That would have been great. Okay. So, like, a lot of chests, I take it, are going to be pretty useless. We're just going to let that one exist there. That's where it's going to live. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think that that was going to work on a wooden boat. But it would have been funny. Excuse me? Excuse me? 
Okay, so some of the things that you encounter is like little, little contingency things in this game. Just, 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 just don't, just don't track for me. I can't believe that that actually worked. Now, it's not going to actually really go anywhere, because I can't steer it. But I can't believe that that actually functioned. A better question, I guess, is why I cannot just take reign of this thing and go with it. But that's fine. I wonder, though. I really do. Oh my god. Oh my god. So in theory, I could just continue to push it across there like an idiot. That's beautiful. Like, that's that's fantastic that I could solve that problem like that. I'm not going to. Because that's incredibly, incredibly dumb. But I'm really glad that that's an option that I've been presented with. Oh, hey, nice. All right. Let's get, like, a bead on where we gotta go and then end it. Oh. Hey guys, how's it going? To be honest, I'm just not interested in dealing with you right now. Oh shit, they're hauling ass. I have no idea if that was actually effective or not, but it was pretty funny as like an idea. Okay, they're just gonna leave me alone. That also works. I also think we've just accidentally found the place we were supposed to go. So, that's pretty good. Oh. Yeah, let's have a go at it. I, too, have a farming implement. I think I can catch yours inside of mine, actually. So that might be a good fight. Oh, yeah. You certainly do seem to be a Hylian. Not one of them dirty Gerudos. Living out in their desert. Having different colored skin than the rest of us. Us Hylians, though, we tend to be good folk. So I'm sorry for threatening to stab you because I don't know who you are. We're all good people here. Threatening to stab each other because we don't know who each other are. I know that when I, like Thad here, meet a person I don't know, I immediately think about stabbing them. There's a thing you have to do here to advance the story so it's a good stopping point. Hello, child. Hey. Tebow. Oh, you're actually pretty cute. <laughs> sure. Um... Alright, well, I didn't intend to get sidetracked by the child, but we're gonna go and get sidetracked. English words. Sidetracked by the child. Okay. That's ominous.
Wow. All right. Yeah, um, excuse me? I didn't consent to this. Uh, kid, what the fuck? Okay, but kid. Thank you, Mr. Shrine and Kakariko, you're gonna regret not doing. Okay. I mean, I can go back. Yeah, I don't really feel like dealing with the devil. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like I said, I can go back. I'm not in a hurry. If I ever feel like needing to do stuff off camera, I can always do that as well. Like, I understand that for the most part, that's not the most desirable thing to do, but... Rusty Halberd. Sure. Like, I don't, I don't like doing stuff on off-camera usually, but, like, getting a shrine here or there is, is not something that I consider to be too terrible. The cost was 120 rupees, by the way. So it's just money. But see, I can put my money to money, money. This is gonna result in me trying to figure out the most optimized gear and I'm gonna kill myself and inevitably just decide to go with whatever I think looks coolest and I'm gonna hate that. Mostly because I'm gonna want a hood or- Oh my god, you're so creepy just standing there like that. You know what? Fair enough. That's understandable, sure. Guys, we're reallocating orbs, but really it's kind of unnecessary. Huh, alright. Um, you know what? We'll... We'll deal all of this another time. Another time. Another place. We'll deal with it another day. <laughs>